There is something experiential and extremely special about being in these forests here. It feels almost mythical, like perhaps a photograph of something you'd see in some deep Amazonian forest, but it's in Australia and it's right here in front of me in Byron Bay. So I became part of Reforest Now and I call them the Rewilding Spartans. They're an incredible team. You couldn't fictionalise this story. It's just an amazing tribe of people committing amazing acts on this planet in the name of goodness and love. So it's a privilege to be a part of it. I've been part of it since the atrocious bushfires that we had about 12 months ago. And that was going through it on the east coast of Australia, like living through hell, Armageddon. So that was the big wake up call for me. It was just time to get on my knees and plant a tree. Coming into an old big scrub area, it's quite moving to um, finally experience what we're actually aiming to recreate in the area. I believe it was one of the largest patches of rainforest in, in Australia and over 99% of it got wiped out by logging and clearing for farmland. And there's only 1%, less than 1% left of the big scrub in the Byron Shire and it's quite shocking because it, it looks so green and, and lush. We talk about all the biology and how it affects humans, you know, the fresh water, the fresh air and we can't survive without it. But there's so much more to a forest and to plants than just the physical aspect. It's got an emotional relationship with us, it's such a healing place. Reforest now does what I and many other scientists believe to be one of the most crucial actions against the ecological and climate crises we face. We've done about 120,000 rainforest trees planted and we're marching forward at about 9,000 trees a week. Reforestation is one of the best tools we have to fight climate change. I grew up watching David Attenborough documentaries and I want all this to be here for, for my children and for future children. I don't just want that record to be digital only. I want the real thing to be there and be visible to them. And obviously the big goal is to try and get maybe up to like a million trees in the next three to four years planted. We're on about over 100,000 now, so that would be a real great thing to have. It's a great experience and it's a great setting. That's all I can say really. Like, if you haven't tried it, come see the rainforest. It will change your life and you get seen stuff that you didn't think you'd ever see.